Hey there, it's Annie Lou. I am doing an experiment. This is my new apron. And you know, when I bought it, I said, I don't know if this is a wise choice. And I was right, it is not a wise choice because you see that spot right there? Yep, it's a grease spot or an oil spot. And um, they're actually all over the apron. I've worn this once. I tucked a towel underneath it and I am going to treat the spots. I went on YouTube to find a DYI cleaning solution, a stain removal solution. And what I found was one part Dawn, one part baking soda, and two parts peroxide. This is what I got. So now I did put a towel underneath my apron, now I am going to saturate those spots, let it soak for about 10, 15 minutes, and then throw it in the wash. And I shall let you know if it worked or not. I hate things with stains. They don't come out, out they go. O-U-T, out. I saturated each spot and just blended it in with a spoon. Now, someone said peroxide will um, bleach out the fabric, maybe. If that's the case, I'm in trouble. All right, I'm going to give this a wash, dry it. I will air dry, I always air dry. Practically everything I air dry, so um, I'll get back to you. As you can see, the stain on the bib of my apron did come out with my DYI cleaner, but it did not take the stains on the bottom of the apron off. The stains on the bottom of the apron, and you can see them right here. And right here. So you can see where the stains did not come out. I do remember having olive oil on my hands and I wiped them on the apron and I said to myself, self, I do not think that was a good idea. And I was right. I'm going to give the scrubby a try now. Now there are no directions on how to use this. It smells just like an orange, and I know that orange is good for cleaning. I am going to wet this. I did put a towel underneath here. I'm also going to wet this with water. Now I am going to scrub. The first time I cleaned this, I did not dry it in the dryer. I put very little in the dryer, actually. So I flipped the soap over. And give it a scrub. So what I have here are the final results of my red apron that had grease spots over here. Now I can faintly see them. Um, and what I used was the scrubby soap. So this is as good as I'm going to get it. And it is fine with me. But I will remember, do not buy aprons in solid colors. As much as I love this apron, not a good color choice. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.